It's like the knowledge of how to spell separate is confined in a separate part of my mind that's shared with, like, my dad whenever I tell him about something that was created in the last 15 years. I know this is how it's spelled, but every time that I get it wrong and have an E instead, it's always, oh, I didn't know that. Oh, that's new. It's like when I've shown my dad a song like 30 times and he still doesn't put together what it is. Like, you know it, but you, you have to be reminded every single time. What I'm going to be changing it to is Splipperip. Splipperip is fun as hell to say. It's essentially split or rip, but a little different. Separate, put things apart to split them. You can do that through ripping as well. Or it's just to mean something different and unrelated. So that's kind of why we switch up what would be the T in split or rip into the P's of splipperip. Plus, I just like having all those P's. It's fun, man. No longer will I misspell separate every time I use it because I'm never going to use it again. This is the new Whiplish variation in Split or Rip. Act accordingly. Song of the Day is New York State of Mind by Nas. I realize that I don't think I've featured Nas very much at all in Song of the Day. This might even be the first one. And so I wanted to remedy that issue and get one of these out. This is one of my favorite Nas songs. I would say one of the greatest rap songs in history. And I don't think that's too big of a leap as this is also considered one of the greatest rap albums of all time. This song is lyrically outstanding. I ain't the type of brother made for you to start testing. Give me a Smith and Wesson, I have niggas undressing. It's so impressive. I feel like if you are into rap, this is a song that you have to hear and kind of analyze and really dive into because it really is a masterpiece, as is most of Illmatic. Then the video of the day is the Easy Cracker edited version. This video is hilarious. It's very heavily edited to just meme the hell out of it. Crack, crack, crack. Cookies, cookies, those cookies, cracker. Over-the-top ridiculous infomercials are some of the best content out there, honestly. Like, they have so much potential to get kind of shit on and made fun of, and it makes for some of my favorite stuff out there. This one's really good, not something I was aware of until recently. Fairly quick watch, would recommend it. That's what we have for the Whiplish lesson. Peace out.